They won't use this. I knocked the U yeah, bend out. <laughs> Hang on, who gets dressed to have sex? <laughs> Big Brother is back. A group of total strangers from all walks of life are essentially going to be locked down together for weeks. What could possibly go wrong? So to get us in the mood for the new series, we've been asking you to send in your most shocking housemate stories. And I tell you what, remember, Big Brother sees it all. But after reading some of these, I feel like I've already seen too much. Maybe with the one who blocked the toilet so badly, the whole toilet had to be taken out and replaced. <laughs> what? what have you done? <laughs> What's that? No, 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 you that can't, can't break no, the toilet. No, because that means the plumber would have had to have removed the toilet with everything in it. <laughs> That's not right. That's not right. Have you ever? Have you ever broken someone's? Have you ever felt? No, I have not. Why I've, are you asking I've, me because that? Because I've done it, but from being sick. You broke I was. I was so. I, I got back from a night out, I, I went to the loo, <laughs> and then I was sick in the loo, and then I sort of passed out, and I, as I fell asleep, this was when I was very young, yeah. I like knocked, they won't use this, I knocked the U-bend yeah, out. <laughs> and, and so everything that was in it fell out, and then it kind of woke me up, and then I just kept flushing. I was like, why is it not flushing properly? And I flooded the whole bathroom, all the neighbouring bedrooms. I got up to stay with my older sister in her uni, and I was not allowed back. <laughs> Disgusting little child. Exactly. So. Um, right. Live with an oddball who assumed it was OK to label his fridge items with Robert's milk, Robert's eggs, Robert's yoghurt. It was infuriating. Now... Let me stop you right uh, there. Are you a labeller? I, I'm on Team Robert. Don't touch my stuff. If if you weren't touching me stuff, I wouldn't need to label it. But your lips are on my milk, drinking directly from the bottle. No wonder I'm having to sell a tape it shut. Yeah. I'm Team Robert all the way. Yeah, fair enough. Because we have You're the oddball. Yeah. Robert's, I'm not that. Yeah, Robert's actually written in. I live with these awful people who kept drinking my milk and <laughs> eating my eggs, so I had to write on them. Yeah. Typical. Honestly. Other side of the story. Do you, do you think Robert wants to get his marker pen out and write on his eggs? No, he doesn't, but he has to. He's been forced into a corner. But you knew. I bought my own mini fridge. Really? Yeah. So you weren't even putting stuff in there? It was getting beyond. And I was like, do you know what? I'm not doing this. I'm getting my own mini fridge. I'm not using the downstairs yeah. fridge. And then you, can, you can have it. Yeah. Have the fridge. And you can just write once on your fridge. <laughs> AJ's fridge. My fridge. <laughs> yeah. Did you have a little look on it? I didn't. <laughs> be... I didn't. That would be the wrong yeah. step too far. I'm not. That's I'm not good. actually an yeah. oddball, yeah. guys. <laughs> oddball, yeah. Uh, well, we're, we're with Rob, Robert. Hashtag I'm with Robert. Hashtag justice for Robert. Yeah, that's going to keep going. OK, uh, here's another one. Sticking a knife in the toaster and blowing the fuse of all eight housemates' rooms wasn't me, says Anonymous. <laughs> God. Wow. Do you know what? You're lucky to be alive. It's really yeah. dangerous, that. Don't go sticking metal items into live toasters. That's you're basic. You're blowing your hand off. Yeah. You're lucky you blew up the veins. That's like the first thing I ever learned in health and safety, like, as a mm. health and safety mm. thing. Don't put a knife in the, in the toaster. One housemate would cut their toenails in the kitchen. Yeah, that's bad. That's bad. That's and do you know bad. what? When you say that's bad, that is bad because you that... do some bad I things. I bite my nails, but I don't put do it in the kitchen. I bite my nails and I don't do them in no. the kitchen. No, there you go. Yeah. Yeah, you're a nail biter as well. Yeah, Thank yeah. you. Good. These are plastic. I've right. stuck them on. Okay, great. Oh, really? Yeah. I thought they were. <laughs> they yeah. just look so real. So real. <laughs> so, yeah. No, they do. They do. They do look real. Um, uh, I, I used to live with somebody at uni who would bite their toenails. <laughs> <laughs> Mic drop. Yeah, yeah. That is it. First, Any camera names? three is just. Yeah. Uh, yeah. No, I can't name names. Guilty, guilty. Robert. Everyone's looking very, very guilty. <laughs> okay, my mate had a life-size cutout of Mel B. Icon. A candle tea light set her on fire. What? But that's blasphemy. That, that's awful. That's, that's blasphemy. Ar that's arson of the worst kind. <laughs> I hope that is. I'm appalled. I think we've got to stop it there. We've got to stop right there. Set Mel B on fire and the house with it. Hopefully not. Yeah, no, well, who cares? What's the point in carrying on? <laughs> <laughs> Mel B's gone. <laughs> That's just... If the cardboard cutout's gone, <laughs> it'll just finish it right yeah. here. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, thank you. You, you. you and your housemate friends are, are worse than anyone possibly imagined. <laughs> That's great.
I genuinely can't imagine being stuck in a house with no. any of those people. No. I mean, I've lived with some stinkers, but that was that was another level. Mm. But I just can't wait to find out what this year's Big Brother housemates are like. Find out exclusively on ITV2 and ITVX. <laughs> 